name is Deborah with Flashback Music Memories. I'm so happy to be here today to celebrate Fern's 90th birthday. I found some songs that will take us on a sentimental journey of Fern's life. So sit back and enjoy this flashback to Fern's past. As many of you probably know, Fern grew up in Kansas, and like a young girl named Dorothy, dreamt of what was over the rainbow. When all the world is a hopeless jumble, and the raindrops tumble all around, somewhere over the rainbow is happy little bluebirds fly beyond the Unlike Dorothy, who wanted to find her way back home, Fern had an adventurous spirit and actually longed to leave her home in Kansas. She may not have had a yellow brick road to follow, but no fence was going to keep her contained. Oh, give me land, lots of land, under starry skies above. Don't fence me in. Well, Fern must have had a spring in her step and a smile on her face because it didn't take her very long to land a job at the phone company. This is the only song I could find about a phone. <laughs> Maybe it sounds a bit funny when I'm away from my honey. Here's what I do with my money. Excellent. <laughs> okay, I've got some trivia for you. Who can name the orchestra who played this song? Glenn Miller. Excellent. And does anybody know what you get if you dial this number? Hotel. A hotel. What hotel? <laughs> That's part of the story. Yeah. So. Fern is now living and working in Los Angeles at Ma Bell, the land of make-believe. Between Hollywood and Disneyland, things can seem a little superficial. Until you fall in love, and then suddenly it all becomes magically real. It's only a paper moon sailing over a cardboard sea. But it wouldn't be make-believe if you believed in me. Well, Fern found somebody to believe in her. And the magic of love made it real for Fern and Phil. They met at church in 1944 and got married the following year. Without your love, it's a honky-tonk parade. Without your love. Well. We're at the last song, and actually this is one I don't sing, but it does represent the music that Fern and Phil used to listen to, possibly from 1951 to 1971 when it was aired, but take a listen to this last song and see if you can name the tune and name the television show. People have guessed correctly, Lawrence Welk. Does anybody know the name of the song? Bubbles. Bubbles in the wine. It's been my pleasure to be here today. Happy 90th birthday, and I hope to be invited back to your 100th, okay?